Good day, girls and boys. Good morning, Chisha. Good day, girls and boys. Good day, Chisha. How are you? I'm fine. And how are you, Chisha? I'm good. Now, our lesson is going to start with a short drama. So I want all those who are going to perform to dress properly. I started the lesson by letting the children to sit down because I wanted them to calm down. As you have seen, we have started with uh, the drama. The story was about William's birthday party. Oh, it's my son's birthday today. I have other ingredients. What must I do? No! approach that I was using that I started with was whole class teaching. All the children must be engaged. All the children must be involved. It was 100% children's participation. I wanted them to own learning. Children must own learning. When they turn around now, it was a shift that now I'm going to be involved. And during that time, it was when now I'm going to do presentation. Girls and boys, who can tell me why was I teaching you that drama? Yes, Akhoputo? Because you wanted to teach us about writing. Yes, because I wanted to teach you about writing. Now, how many types of writings have we done already? Yes, Lalefa? Six types of writing. Yes, we have done about six types of writing. Right. I want volunteers who will come up and pick up any weight. When you pick a weight, you raise it up, you read it, and the other children will read also, and then I will paste it on the chalkboard. What do you have? Cooking instruction. He has got cooking instruction. He has got cooking instruction. What do you have? A letter. He has got a letter. What do you have, Lerato? Lerato has got a story. The children did uh, different types of writing. And I was doing that because I wanted to make revision of what they've done before. Those types of writings were the letters, the diary entry, and so on. So now, girls and boys, we have done all this. This was just revision. But the most important thing today is that we are going to edit. 
We have done all this. I've got your scripts. You are going to edit your work. But now you need to, to, to revise. What is it that you are going to do when we edit? I've got some few children who knows it. Do not erase. You take color pencil to edit. Read your word thoroughly. Are the symptoms understandable? Do they make meaning? I don't want them correctly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So it means that these are the tools of editing. Whenever you have written something, you must edit it, but you need to have the tools to edit your work. I want you to tell me that you have had all the editing tools. When we edit, we follow all the editing tools. That is number one, we follow all the editing tools. And when you edit, you correct your mistakes on the way written and write the correct thing. When they are writing, there are instructions. When you bake a cake, you don't just do anything whenever you want. Those rules, they are actually helping me and helping the children to develop their writing skills. I was convinced that now they understand and they know what they are going to do. So I let them sit in groups. Let me have the read group on your table. You will find your apparatus on the table. You have the letter alphabet. You are going to call the names. You build the letters. You read the letter and you write it down. And somebody is going to be a scribe. Somebody who is going to write. How many words have you read and how many words were you able to read? The yellow group, you have pencils on your table. You are going to arrange the sentences. Put them correctly. Which one came first? Which one came second? When you finish, copy the sentences. Here are the worksheets and the pencils. Is that okay? Look at me. You finish editing, is it? Yes. Now, the writing rule says that at the end, after <coughs> editing, you must read your work aloud. Now, let's listen to a wonderful story. Sulem's birthday party. On Friday, it was Sulem's birthday party. The party was at extension 71 house number 07431 next to the Africa shop. I gave them this different task because learners differ with abilities of learning in the classrooms. The lesson was effective. Once the children are more involved than the teacher, it means they are learning. They were free to speak. So when you teach this type of a lesson, you must take your time and you will get what you want. Mm -hmm.